Hello everyone. So today we are going to see what happens if I click on create strategies using AI. So let's see everyone. So it takes me to a tool called Phoenix Copilot, which is a tool used to generate and create any algo trading strategy using simple normal prompts. So let's say I want to use a RSI and EMA combination and generate a strategy. How I will do that? Let me show it to you guys. I'll just click on any one of the prompt over here. Let's say I have chosen this, which is only using RSI to generate buy and sell signals. So I want to combine EMA as well in it. So what I'll write is create a strategy that uses RSI and EMA. indicator to give signals based on overbought, oversold, crossover and cross under. Just give a comma over here. Oversold. After oversold a new comma. Now we will write the logic at which it will buy or sell. Let's say if the EMA of shorter period, like I can also rephrase it as if the short period EMA is greater than the long period EMA and RSI is above, let's say, 50. Okay. Then it should generate a buy signal. And if, let, let me copy and paste it again. Uh, I just have to reverse the order over here. So I'll just copy and paste it. Copied. And if the long or maybe, you know, you can write it larger period EMA as well is greater than the short and the RSI is below. 50 it should generate a sell signal not setting a stop loss not setting a target right now just defining what indicators it will use and what what should be the conditions of buy and sell signals just press enter and see the magic As you can see, the code is generating, which will be used for maybe backtesting on this strategy. Maybe you can use paper trading on this strategy and also you can run live trading as well. Now in the rightmost panel, we can see how we can customize the generated code. You can add any instrument which you want over here. Let's say I will add Reliance. I'll just type out Reliance. It will come up over here and I've added it. Okay. Then I can click on Advanced Customization. Step one is to configure the configuration parameters. So I'll open the configuration panel. I can change the candle size to maybe like 15 minutes. Let it be intraday. The max order count, let me change it to 150. The credit exposure factor will remain as it is. 
let's say my short EMA period is 9 and my long EMA period is 18. My RSI period is 14. Let it be like that. So these all parameters can be changed from here very easily, not even writing in the prompt. Now the step two is select backtest over here. I can change the time duration as well. I will right now choose six months. We can also choose one year as well. We can change the quantity over here. That is, I may make the quantity as 100. Make sure to keep it as more than 100. Now then we have a PNL tracker. This PNL tracker, we can set the stop loss and the target. Let's say I can set my target as 10,000 and my stop loss as 3,000. And after doing all these customizations, if I want to backtest this strategy, I'll just click on backtest. The backtest is running, guys, as you can see. It takes some time to just load to generate results. Let's just wait for some time. The back test will be done in a couple of minutes. As we can see, the back testing rules has been completed. I can see the total returns that the strategy has made, the max drawdown and the average hit ratio. To understand more about this, you can click on get advanced analytics. In the analytics section, we can see more of variables like total wins, total losses, average HIT ratio, total long trades, total short trades, maximum loss and maximum profit. All these things you can see. You can also watch the graphs of cumulative returns, the PNL graph, end of year returns, distribution, monthly returns daily returns, underwater drawdown plot. Apart from that, we have the PNL book, which first shows the gross ROI, the trading volume and the total number of trades placed. Uh, it has a heat map of every month uh, and has all the list of the PNL columns in here. Next, we can also check the logs of this thing. It has the detailed logs of when, when the order was set, when the trade happened, when short trade happened, when long trade happened, and many more details inside these logs. So this is how you can use Phoenix Copilot to backtest your strategy. You can also live trade with it in Phoenix by clicking on that button which I showed. You can set your parameters before you know using this strategy as i i want it to be like this only you can change the name over here let's say i'll keep it as ema rsi just given a hyphen in between so now this is my name of the strategy i can also remove this as well if i want Now I can click on save. It has saved the strategy now. Now what I can do is I can add the strategy in my portfolio. If I go to my portfolio, here we are. The strategy is added in my portfolio. Now I can, you know, backtest it. I can paper trade with it. I can also live trade with it. 
So thank you everyone. This is how you can use Phoenix Copilot to create any strategy using simple prompts to, to backtest any strategy to run paper trade and, and as well as live trade if you know a little bit of Python. So thank you everyone and I see you in the next video.